Hi, good morning. We are on page 62, reading the story. Um, we were on the commandment called, oh, not called, but it was remember the Sabbath day and keep it holy. See, six days you shall labor and do your work, but the seventh day is the Sabbath. So no one should be doing work on the Sabbath. What number was that? One, two, three, four. That was commandment number four. Let's review the other ones just briefly. Number one, you shall have no other gods before me. Number two, you shall not make yourself an image in any form of God. Um, you should not bow down or worship idols. Number three, you shall not misuse the name of the Lord. And number four, keep the Sabbath holy. Okay, so we are on number five. Um, honor your father and mother so that you may live long in the land of the Lord. Baby, that's too loud. Um, you may live long in the land of the Lord your God that the Lord your God is giving you. How do I say that? Obey, so. obey your father and mother. Honor and obey your mama and your daddy that it may go well, well with you and you will live a and that is what I want for you. And that is what I want for you. Um, and obey with a happy heart. Yes. Um, so, yeah, that one's pretty important, especially for us parents. Um, this one is also pretty important in our culture, I feel like, because in our culture, we're, we're really experiencing a division of the family. Um, there's a constant pulling apart of parent and child um, that's really, you know, it pretty, puts pressure on the children when you send the children to a bunch of different people throughout the day, a teacher, their other teacher, the other teacher after that, your science teacher, your math teacher, the coach uh, of their team, um, the after school program director, suddenly they're under a bunch of rules and it becomes very confusing uh what rules do we obey um so you know anyway that's why it's important for us that's why i stay with y'all we have one consistent set of rules um number see that was five six you shall not murder i think that one is self-explanatory <laughs> um although uh, the Lord said that if you are, if you have hate for someone in your heart, then it's like you've already murdered them. So really it's a heart position and not just an action because, yes, what is it? Sometimes they get a rebellious anger at people through like a hate. I guess it's sometimes like I murdered them. Well, you, it, it's the heart position that's most important because our thoughts and our heart positions become our words and that becomes our action. Or thoughts can become actions also immediately. You shall not commit adultery. Um, that means you shall not, if you're a, a, a man, you shall not love another woman like a wife if she's not your wife. Um, if you're a woman, you shall not love a man like a husband if he's not your husband. And sometimes people point to figures in the Bible like Abraham or Jacob. You know, Abraham loved Hagar like a wife but she wasn't his wife and Jacob loved who? Caleb, you can't look at that. You can hold on to something. Let me have that, please. Right, so, Rebecca and Rachel. Who was who? I, it was Isaac and... Uh, Rebecca, sorry. Rachel and Leah. Leah, Rachel and Leah, I've got it. Okay, um, so, but Jacob loved, um, Leah's servant also like a wife then he loved